all right friends so we've dropped a couple of more uh, of our stickers off I actually gave one to a gentleman that is uh, traveling to the Philippines so let's see how far this uh, this sticker can go and come back so do you guys think I'd get in a bunch of trouble if I stuck it right here on one of these terminals I won't put my phone number or address or nothing yeah. on there so. <laughs> no I wouldn't do that but yeah having a great time uh, you guys are gonna absolutely go bonkers for the next story time <clears throat> alrighty so uh, I really haven't got a whole lot of video up to this point um, but I'm on the window side so we will get some high in the sky it's a big old plane there So yeah, we, we, oh look at the big, oh my god, that one's, no, no, I guess it's the same size, ain't it? No, that one's much bigger than this one, oh my god. Maybe not. I, uh, like I said, absolutely no sleep last night at all, the night before, I only got just a couple of hours, have not had a cigarette since 5 o'clock yesterday afternoon. I am absolutely, um, yeah, I'm about ready to <laughs> Alrighty, so we're getting ready to take off out of Chicago here. I'll try to get a little footage of that, but I was just uh, looking at some pics on Facebook and the um, um, fire that went through Metanoma Falls is absolutely um, it's absolutely heart wrenching I, I anytime I ever go through that way up I-84 always stop because it is such a, an amazing spot and it is absolutely gone well, look at this. I mean, they got. Oh my God, this place is busy. So there's one taking off right now. One, two, three, four planes ahead of us. We're five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So yeah, there's ten planes. Well, nine now because one just took off. Lined up to take. Off. This place is. I mean, it's. As it, 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 it's pretty cool because as we're like coming around to take off another one is coming in over top of us and landing and, but I actually was was quite surprised and uh, I don't know whatever made me think this or feel this way but uh, I thought that this was supposed to be like some huge airport and it's it's not Orlando was a lot bigger a lot nicer um, I just got a, a text message from Travis. I want to make sure and let you know I was representing. So we'll get out to you guys in a bit. Uh, so as you can see, there's just the two of us. We won't be horribly, horribly cramped in, which will be pretty cool. Get you another shot of the airport there. Um, and also that... Uh, <laughs> I introduced myself and stuck my hand out to shake his hand and said, um, I think that we should know each other's names because there is a good chance that I will be the last person you see if this plane goes down.
front view or an overhead compartment. Please make sure your seat belts are bent and seat backs and train tables are upright and headrests are lowered. Flight attendants, please prepare the cabin for arrival and be seated. Alrighty, so we're making our approach into Pittsburgh. It won't be long and I'll be at, at Stump's place. Um, I'm absolutely ringing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty tired, so we'll definitely be getting some good videos out to you guys soon. Okay, so, you know, like, I, I'm, I'm not sure, oh, there's a plane down there. <laughs> um, I've never GoPro'd out of a plane or anything, so I don't know how this is going to turn around, but uh, it's just kind of neat that the uh, area, here flying it's been um fairly i guess somewhat rural you know quite a few houses uh, but just as we made the turn to come in and i hope this comes out but there's a, a lot and lot more trees bam, 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 you know everywhere still not the hills and whatnot that i am used to um but just funny you know silly things like that now you know we can't go 25 miles that way in the uh you know it, it, it'll go back into either more holes or more just rolling grass hills or hours gotta love it Alrighty, so hey and gentlemen welcome to pittsburgh the local time is 10.05 Coast. Oh, they got these these fancy ass uh, moving floors. <laughs> if you're not careful, if you're not careful coming up. Oh God! And they got a cinnamon, and I haven't eaten yet. Anyways, if you're not careful coming off of these things, uh, paying attention on that end, you will fall down. So I need to find my last gate. It'll take me here from Pittsburgh uh, to a smaller town closer to Stump. Should be, wouldn't be much more than just a couple, a couple, three more hours, I think. Alrighty, so we got Franco Harris here. Um, I'd like to spend a little more time with him, get to know him a little better. Maybe we could all have a discussion with him. But I haven't had a cigarette since 5 o'clock last night, and I don't have a whole lot of time, so we're on our mission. And they have, <laughs> oh, I guess it's called Sports Z Berg. But it would be just the same as for me being at home, going to the duck store. Um, oh. Oh, I see some hat wear there that may, uh, probably not here. Um, I paid $13.25 for a sandwich at the last airport. So I can guarantee you the price of that thing. But anyway, so yeah, we'll be getting some, some new headgear while we're here. Yeah, they got some good ones. All right. Okay, so, um, so far, um, I guess I'd have to give a, a mixed, um, had some fairly nice people, uh, you know, helpful, whatnot. I did pass, just pass some people sitting in a, in a, uh, airport whatever you'd want to call it eating cheese and meat and whatever else off of a plank of wood <laughs> um alrighty oh uh and there's been a couple of uh not so nice people 
you're gonna get that anywhere you go all right so oh there it is there it is okay so i found my gate i still haven't had a cigarette i'm going to have a cinnabon and uh we'll get back to you guys